Hello, my name is Luke Albert, and next year I will be attending Harvard University. Luke always had in mind to go to a highly selective school, and at first there was a number of different choices, but as he moved through the process, he realized that it would be better to focus, really focus intently on one. So he decided on Harvard, um, his sister went to Harvard, dad went to Harvard, um, and so he already knew the place. Um, but as with any highly selective school, there's a lot of nerves in that, but he ended up doing the work. He, he had the credentials in terms of his grades, in terms of the scores, in terms of his leadership opportunities, in terms of his service, in terms of all of those things, um, being actively involved in uh, political arenas and that sort of thing. Um, and he worked hard. He worked hard on his application and his essay and ultimately um, he was able to do what a lot of people aren't, which is gain admi admittance to probably the top school in the United States. Cassidy's really done an outstanding uh, job helping me figure out how to handle a pretty decent workload on my own time and uh, establishing a strong work ethic and finding time to get around my work and my extracurricular activities. On top of that, I think Cassidy's been really important as both a cooperative and competitive environment and that it, uh, it, it puts you in situations where you have to work with other students to find solutions that you otherwise would not be able to do so by yourself. And that's something I believe is gonna be absolutely vital to when I go on to the next stage of my education. Uh, Cassidy has a very rigorous curriculum uh, across all areas, but whether it's humanities, social sciences, natural sciences, physical sciences, and, and I think that combined with the artistic and spiritual growth and, and environment you get here uh, prepared him to where I have absolutely no fear that he will fit in and be able to handle the workload. Now, you know, Cassidy is an outstanding academic school and, and prepared Luke uh, to go up uh, and compete against the best. I kind of had an idea that like if I could get in there, like that'd be the place I'd want to go. But when I visited, I knew definitely that was my number one choice, and that's where I wanted my future to be. It was a big change in a big city, and both of those things are things I realized I absolutely desired, and I'm happy enough to be saying that's where my future is taking place. I was just kind of stuck there in a moment. I clicked on it, and once again, I was kind of frozen couldn't really make sense of the words on the screen as I finally read, you know, congratulations, you got accepted, welcome to, you know, Harvard class of 2022. And I was just a little stunned for about three minutes. And then the second it really kind of dawned on me, I just, I remember sprinting out of my room screaming, I got in. Um, I think the tears started pouring at that point. Man, when he found out, we were screaming and crying, and my husband and I both tripped over each other to climb the stairs to get to his uh, bedroom where he was jumping up and down after having just been told online, congratulations. Throughout the process, all of our college counselors, but my specific college counselor was Dr. Hubble, and she was so incredibly vital to the college application process. I mean, she, she kept me on deadlines, um, she kept a schedule, and on top of that, she went like the extra, extra yard just to help make sure I was the best applicant. I definitely don't think I would have been able to do it without her, and I'm incredibly grateful for that reason. You know, on June 2nd, uh, when he graduates, uh, I can tell you there'll be a lot of tears because we've spent a lot of years here at Cassidy and they've been wonderful years. Our daughter first started at uh, primary in 1989. So that shows you how long we've been Cassidy parents. And I think next month, or yes, in about a week, I will pay my last Cassidy tuition <laughs> check. And so uh, there will be tears and cheers, but it's been a wonderful experience and I, I, I you know, if we had to do it all over again, they'd go to Cassidy.